Hello all, Havoc here. Okay, so I just lost 30 minutes of content because my recording software stopped. So, um, hi, welcome back. Um, let me bring you up to speed. So, um, this is the glass I picked. I, I went through all of the black stained glass mm -hmm. options, and this is what I went with. I added a little bit of the uh, gilded in the top. I cut the gilded out of the back this stuff right here, cut it out, and put it into the sky block because, yeah, I like the way it looks when you look through this and through that, and that's back there. Okay, so this will probably, that pattern there is actually probably going to get transposed out to here. So it'll be like this, but with this around it, out here. I still have to do something for the floor, so that's to happen sooner but right now what i'm trying to do is get the uh, mob farm up and running i have the mob masher and all of the upgrades for mob grinding utilities and emc let's see uh that was right about where it left off I'm very frustrated with that so uh let's get this move to about there this guy goes here does that okay it's got all the upgrades in it, so definitely need to be careful of that Mamma Jamma. I don't need the fan upgrades because I'm not sure if I'm going to use interdiction torches or vector plates. Vector plates. Uh, this is extreme. That's as far as we can go. Uh, they're not really that expensive. It's just a lot of sugar, a lot of gold, and both of those are EMCable, and so are those. So once we, actually, we already have the extreme, so we just need to EMC it. I think we're going to do vector plates in both farms. Yeah. Yeah, it's just going to be a thing. It's just going to make it easier. So let's get over here. Those are all of our mob utilities. Uh, we can throw in all of this now. So I didn't mean to throw my diamond wand in. Ooh, your EMC also? Or that's going to go in there. Okay. So... You're going in there, you're going in there. Yeah. So that'll be like that. I just need two of these. Actually, right now, I just need the one. Uh, that'll do it. So the goal is to get this thing up and running, get all the item collections and everything all set up and prepped so it's working and functioning the way I want it to before I turn it on. That's the plan. <laughs> Best laid plans. All right. Which way do you go? Uh, wrench? Yeah, buddy. All right. So it means we need to go this way. <gasps> Ooh, that's quick. Okay. This thing's gonna be stupid efficient. It'd be more efficient if I didn't do that. As I was saying. I hesitated there for a fraction of a second on the pinky, holding down that shift key. All right. Oh, I like the darkness. I need darkness, so. Okay. 
I'm going to have to do some fancy digging after this to go and find all the feral torches that I have buried to get the light sources out of here. Did not plan that far ahead on that part. And we let go shift and bam, we're there. It looks cool too, by the way. <laughs> Actually, hold on. All right, so what I want to do is come over here, take this block out, take that block out, and put the cursed earth there. And put those two blocks back because so I can place this and it'll face the correct direction. So, yeah, that works. Okay, so now I want to put this onto some type of storage device. I want it to be huge. Uh, whatever we're going to use for storage has got to have some capacity. Um, where did our storage go? Storage scanner. Um, modular storage right there. Okay, so we need to make that. That's the thing. Really? It's a lot of storage. There it is. That's EMCable, so I want to go do that. And then all the way up to the tier four. What is the tier four diamond thingy? What is that? Infused diamond. But dimensional shards. How many dimensional? Oh, dimensional shards are EMCable. What? Really? And they're craftable? What? Uh, a lot of what on that. Let's head back. Just take care of that and get that upgrade going. Okay, so that can go in there. Uh, dimensional shards. Uh, yeah, those are EMCable. That's wasn't expecting that. Actually, I'll put it down here. And infuse diamond. Actually, just put this bad boy in. We have no reason to have a tier one. Or a tier two. Or a tier three. Let's go straight for the big mama gemma. Okay, tier four. Those are EMCable. I'm going to go ahead and do that. Because I don't know if those are going to come up again. And they have a quarter of a million EMC value. So, modular storage, tier four. Wabam. That is a spicy meatball. All right, so remote storage module. This storage module is for modular storage block. I don't know how that works. Okay. Um, so yeah. Then this bad boy goes in here. Take a couple of those, 
couple of those. Whoa. I did not think those were going to stack. Better. All right, so this bad boy is going to go right across the hall. I love these things because they don't take EMC. I saw that green and I thought it was a creeper. I was like, what? no, okay. So that bad boy goes there. This thing goes into there. Holds 500 stacks. That's awesome. That's like a lot. Sort by count. It's great. So now this bad boy. Uh, what? No. Hmm. Should we change this? I think we need to change this. So I think I'm gonna put this here, this here. Um, I don't recognize whether it grabbed it or not, so or range shown, whitelist, we're still gonna filter things. Cool. So full time show range now. So we want to go that one. No. That's fine, that range. That's the range we want to go up by one. Ugh. Uh, go up by one more. Yeah, that'll work. Range off. Let me just do something like that. No, actually, I can't. Okay, so that's going to go into there, and then we're going to item conduit it out of there. Oh, he's, oh, I was going to say, it looks like he's flying around, so he's free. All right, so we're going to item conduit out of there into the storage controller, and then we're going to have to set up a drawer system over here. Do I want to do that, or do I want to just pipe it all? I'm torn between just piping it all into EMC and sending it back home. Hey, I was looking for you. Oh, that's good. I need that gone. Okay. Um, let's see. If I do this, is that no? Not yet. Um. I think I'm gonna just pipe it all in the EMC. No, I'm gonna pipe it all home. Yep, I'm just gonna pipe it all home. Nope, I'm not. Yes, ah. Okay, I got an idea. So, what I'm going to do is put this stuff into here. So, what I'm going to do is the next building is going to be a warehouse. I need to build a warehouse. I'll build it. Uh, Right across from the blacksmith, that makes sense. So build it right here. 
and that's where all it's going to go. We're going to put it into a different um, ender chest. We'll do a different color uh, network, and we'll take all the stuff from there and send it into the warehouse, which will be full of our storage drawers. And then we can use the storage drawers to link up to uh, our refined storage network. We're going to run a cable underground, link it all up to it, and all that shenanigans. So, well, that gives you something to do for the next episode. <laughs> so today's episode is going to be a little on the short side. Uh, like I said, I lost over 20 minutes of time just for my recording software noping out on me. And uh, yeah, when it does that, it corrupts our footage, it makes it useless. And I had already had everything built. So this one here, by the way, is going to be from uh, Mob Slime, the pink slime. So we're going to do a slaughter factory over here, and then we'll do the crusher over here. So this one's going to be all about just the loots. They'll both get loots, but this one here is not going to be as fast as this one, I don't think. So, I don't know. Time will tell. Thanks for being all the support you guys bring to the channel. The comments are fantastic. Keep them coming. And uh, this build is going to continue to evolve and devolve <laughs> as things progress. Appreciate you being here. This is Havoc. Have fun. And keep gaming.